Right everyone, happy Sunday. Hello, welcome back, welcome to another video. Um it's gonna be um like on the day video. I've done a car beat this morning and that means that I've been able to walk around, find some more treasure. So I'm gonna show you that now. I've just made myself a nice cup of tea in this really unusual um if you can see here, very it's like a handmade mug basically, and I got that from a charity shop shot recently um which i think is absolutely it's just absolutely beautiful and amazing i love it so i've got a cup of tea in that and i've just made myself one so um yeah that, that's that basically um but yeah i went to a car beat this morning and it was really good to be fair um so i'm gonna film this and put this video out the same day um i've just been a little bit quiet i'm not gonna show you my face just because um you know just not presentable at the moment um but it's, i've been a little bit quiet it's just been a little bit manic for me um but i wanted to touch base so hello i hope you're all good um so i've been to the car boot like i said but i just want to mention because i've been doing some charity shopping as well and um, but i picked this up um the other day and i really wanted to just mention this first of all because this is kind of just an insight of just the amazing things that you can pick up from charity shops car boots all that type of thing really um all second hand um and i got this beautiful um it's called a brick um but essentially you put flowers in i'll put a picture up but i got this from um a charity shop from compton care it cost me one pound 75 i have took the sticker off now um but it is an emma bridgewater and i've looked online looked at the prices and the fact that i paid 175 for this and people have got these on ebay for like what 30 35 pound um an absolute steal so i really wanted to show that first of all it is you know getting a little bit more autumn is in it so that the season even though it's been absolutely scorching over the last week. But I definitely think it's just going to go downhill now. Um, but this is very like spring type in my opinion. I love it. And what I might do, because I am going to transition into autumn with my decor um, in a few weeks. Um, what I'm going to do is I might put this away ready for the spring next year so i've got some nice decor pieces i think i might actually go through some of the things that i've already got because you know when you do second hand and um, you go to charity shops you end up buying stuff and then you've just accumulated things so um that's why it's always good to do maybe do a car boot because then you can um pop these things away anyway so let's see what i picked up from the car boot this morning so let's have a look um i might as well show you this because i've been pinpointing it um it looks a little bit more it doesn't look very good on this camera i'm not gonna lie but it's a it's a much more blue in person it looks very gray and dull but um it looks pretty much brand new but it doesn't look very good on this camera anyway so it is literally just like a shirt type like a baggy shirt it was from h&m um, very crease i need to wash it and iron it it looks like she's barely worn it but on here it looks terrible but i promise you um i'm not sure if that's gonna give it it's like it's just a much more blue in person like it looks a bit gray on here but anyway so i got this shirt which i thought was really nice like a white vest top underneath just really chilled um you know i don't know just i just thought it was really nice to be honest so i think i brought that and this was one pound fifty which i didn't think was too bad um i've got some of these jars so and i thought these was like really really handy so this one has got pasta spaghetti so i've got spaghetti in my cupboard but i haven't got a jar for it and i thought that was perfect so that was 50p so i've got this one and then i've got this one which i really really liked because i like the um the lid um on it i don't know what i'm gonna use this for but you know when you see it for 50p and you're like i'm gonna i'm gonna use that for something um it's just useful for the cupboards isn't it even if you put like biscuits in there um sweets um your tea bags you know all those different things so sometimes i have excess tea bags um that if they don't fit in my in my tub that i've already got anyway i don't know they were 50 pence each i'm just gonna have a quick swig of my cup of tea make sure you do as well 
because um it's an absolute must anyway so um one of the other things i got which was this bag for a pound it's a much more burgundy color um in person than on camera but i liked it because this is the handle it's like a nice little shopper i would say even i don't know to be honest it's just really really nice um nice and basic and this was from if i show you um defining Mo movement sorry in clark's which you know it absolutely looks in it's just incredible really i just really liked it i thought that's a nice little shopper um you know if you're out and about maybe going to the charity shops and you only buy a couple of things um but it's it's again the same as this that's a much more deeper burgundy i'm not sure that you're going to be able to tell I think it's the light, I'm not sure. But I picked this up and then I got like a little lunch bag because I've got one from Arm Bargains, but it's getting a little bit it's very summery and I just thought that was just a nice one to be honest. So I'm going to start using that for work. Um, really like that. And then one of the things that I did pick up, so from my lady, she was just getting rid of loads of stuff. This was another steal. So these are both Kath Kidson. So this one, it's still got the little um, plastic thing over the name, if you can see there. Um, this was, if it's going to focus, this was 50 pence. So I'm not sure if I open this. Uh, it doesn't look too bad in there. I don't think so. Um, but anyway, this was 50p. So I thought, well, I'll get this. In fact, I had both for £1.50, which is mad, really, if you think about it. And um, this is like a wash bag. Um, so doesn't look too bad inside. Um, looks very good and decent nick. Um, that's the bottom bit. Because, you know, sometimes with this kind of material, it can go um bad i don't know look it just kind of gets a little bit tatty um and then just all the labels um there if you can see i don't know i just thought it was really nice because i got rid of loads of stuff um in terms of like wash bags and chris has got one and we go on holiday um in a few weeks so i thought well i've actually got my own that i can just pop things in and it's from kath kidson which for one pound fifty i'm not sure what i can use this for um but i got it anyway because it's just it's just one of them i'm just buying bags and do i really need them but i really like this color because it's very like an autumnal color so i really like that um then i've got this which it's already got a wax thing in there but i thought that was really nice and sleek um and it's from yankee and gone this was a pound um yankee candle so i thought that i don't i mean do i need it no um, but I just liked um, the simplicity of it. And I've ordered some wax melts off um, an Etsy site. So what I'm going to do is, once they arrive, I'm going to clean this um, and put the wax melts in there. So that's really nice. And I'm going to kind of like, I think I'm going to get rid of my other ones. Um, they're not serving me anymore. So I think I'm just going to use this and have like a nicely, nice basic one. I think that's really nice. Um, what else have we've got? We've got a water bottle um you have made it through 100 of your bad days and i just love the pattern on there um and that's the lid so i'll give that um a bit of a wash um and then i picked this up and i really like this this was from um what is it this is from originally matalam because i recognize that and i thought oh this looks all right so it's this love art um little shelving unit i mean they've put oops they've put this little lace on there but i'm going to take that off um but it's a little shelving unit and what i'm going to do above where i've got like my jewelry my perfumes i'm going to hang this on the wall and i'll see how it is um I've got the washing machine on if you're wondering what that noise is in the background see if i can fit like perfumes on there but if not some like all the little trinkets and i thought because i need some in the bedroom it's kind of lacking something so that was two pound um it was a lady who was next to us uh, at the car boot so she let me have that for two pound which i can imagine that being at least 10 15 quid 
all the rest from Matalan. And then the last couple of things that I've got, I've got this little white um, cushion. That's 50p. Um, give that a wash and it looks really, really good condition. And it's getting like, warmer as well. No, it's getting it's not getting warmer, it's getting like into that season towards the end of September, October, where it's gonna get a little bit more chilly, and I want everywhere to be nice and cozy. Um, because it's our first Christmas in this house. And then I picked this brand new throw, it's a yellow throw, and it's from Asda originally. I mean, look at the label, it's it's basically just never been worn. And again, I've got this. Um, I'm gonna just make sure that everywhere is nice and cozy the washing machine that's really loud i'm going to see if i can just shut that door um but that's everything that i've picked up from the car boot this morning i don't think it was too bad i think um, i picked up some really good gems to be honest um i just love everything that's like a pound 50p like just that's what you go for a car boot for isn't it just really nice and cheap anyway i am going to finish off my cup of tea in my little unique mug um i hope you have a great rest of the sunday and the great rest of the what i don't even know what i'm saying now i'm so tired i've been up since like half five this morning um but have a great rest of the week um as well hope it's productive or if not that's fine as well and uh yeah i don't know what else to say to be honest i'll see you in my next video whenever that is comment down below subscribe and like the video if you do and i'll see you very very soon thanks guys bye i can't let you go baby i just want to tell you